I think where it really contributes a lot of value is you go in and you sit alongside other aspiring leaders, business owners, you know, looking to become good too, a great. And, and when you, you have that interaction with them, it takes your confidence to another level to see that there are other people just like you trying to figure things out. Um, but also that you get a sense of belonging. Like, you know, when you sit in that room and you have a leadership personality, you can see the similarities regardless of the different levels that you're at, you know, in your development and your career. So I thought that that was really interesting. But I'll also share, you know, we were um, going through a lot of different uh, exercises before we went into MAP. And then to go into MAP and learn about their system and you know, uh, take away things like the vital few, Pareto principle, feedback loops, and all of these legitimate tactics, you know, that are implemented into leadership or running a business. It really helped me kind of come back with um, not just better confidence, but like actual takeaways that I could apply to the organization and help inspire other employees too. Yeah, I remember this very vividly. Um, you know, the instructor said that you should just try to take 10% this weekend because, you know, it's a fire hose in the amount that you learn. And, of course, I said, well, I'm going to take 15, watch. Um, you know, instantly when I came back from California, I had created poster boards, placed them all over the wall because I was trying to retain everything that I could. And some of those things that I thought were, were essential, they were always about how you, you apply your time. Um, you know, the Pareto principle, it was huge. Like, how are you getting the full value out of your time? What things should you actually be focused on as a leader versus delegating to someone else? How many training opportunities are you stealing from other motivated individuals within your company that could handle the things that you're scared to let go of? Uh, the feedback loop was essential too. Communication was a game changer. It, it, it raised my awareness on how often we deliver a message and don't realize that the message is not received the same way that it's delivered. So something as simple as, hey, can you repeat back to me, you know, what, what I just said right there? And you might find that, you know, the lack of alignment is, is pretty tremendous. I think the value of a program like MAP is when you walk away, you know, with more confidence as a leader, more experience as a leader, um, that's a gift that keeps on giving. I would be doing MAP a disservice to try and put a specific headcount, dollar, or anything on it. Because the truth is, is that it's going to continue to give and give and give as I develop, because it changed the way that I thought. And it also made me look at leadership in different ways that are still giving back to this organization today. The MAP program was everything that I hoped it would be. It was a creative program that was really engaging. It caused me to really think. It caused me to reflect and lean into discomfort and do all the things that I had to do to really evolve as a leader and contribute the value that I hoped to bring to Rhino Strategic Solutions. Because of MAP, it opened up my mind to so many different tactics and perspectives that it created this domino effect, you know, for the years to come. I highly recommend MAP. Uh, it is a very creative and thoughtful way um, to get a team member to have to self-reflect about the things that are necessary for them to take the next step. It's hard to become great. It's hard to become undeniable. It's hard to become, you know, the best leader that you can be without also being the best learner you can be. And I think that it's important, you know, to have a mentor or um, a coach or a program that forces you to have to lean into the discomfort that's created about getting anonymous feedback on how you could be a better individual. I would strongly consider, um, you know, sending the team to MAP. I highly recommend it. It definitely resulted in my growth, and I'm a, a huge fan.